What's your advice to that young film, filmmaker listening that wants to be a cinematographer working in film? It, it, it's hard. And it's hard just because there's, a, uh, there's such an oversaturation in this market. But I really do feel like the only way to really get yourself out there is to make make your own content. Find find a director. Um, if you're a DB, find a director that you you you, you collaborate well with and, and, and really invest in that. Um, and vice versa, if you're a director, find a DP that, that works well with you and and invest in that like i i came up through art school and i um and i just told myself i'm a dp i'm going to be a dp i do not want to work my way up i'm going to work a day job get money and put that money into my projects and i i would always tell myself if i can't invest in my own work then why would anyone else do that um but i will say the 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 only reason that worked for me was i did find that other person who had ideas and had scripts that i really that really spoke to me um and we would just learn how to do something out of nothing we would have put together five thousand dollars and shoot a short film and and that would be the beginning of, of of our trip to sort of do that again and then get slightly more money and then do that again um and producing that 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 work where you can control the voice and control the content and, and really control the feeling of it is what will represent you the best in my opinion that's wild so you didn't mentor you didn't start as like a you know an ad uh, ac nothing no, I, I think I AC'd one film for uh, four hours, and then I, I, I sort of said I feel sick and went home and didn't come back the next day. Wow. Was, I, just, I just hated it. I've, I've always I, – I, I don't like it. I like, I like the conceptual feeling of, of really helping someone construct this incredibly difficult medium that we're in. Um, so I, I always wanted to be on this side, and I, I've I've always had this feeling like techni technicality doesn't mean anything. If you don't if you don't know something, hire someone in your crew that knows that. Um, learn learn from your crew, and that's what I would do. I would always just hire a gaffer that knew much more than me. Hire hire an AC that knows more about the camera than you, uh, and learn from them. Um, and when you don't know something, ask. Um, and in the end, um, I feel like you you can spend more time building out the conceptual side. Um, and figuring out how you want, you know, for me, for me, language is everything. I really, I really believe that. Um, I think at this point, uh, cameras have gotten so accessible and, and, and good that any, any DP can shoot a good looking image. Um, I think it comes down to language and how you use that camera and how you use that lens and how you use that lighting to build something that feels unique in some way. What was the day job? I worked at a grocery store in Norway called Kiwi. Uh, and if you Google Kiwi grocery store in Norway, you will see that they wear uh, neon green outfits uh, that are incredibly disgusting. Um, but I, I, I did that from 17 until 26 every every summer. And I would just take all that money and, you know, I'd go back to Norway during the summer, go back to Vancouver where I was doing my degree and, and spent my time um, and just put that into film as much as possible. 